hi guys welcome back to the channel if you're new welcome please subscribe and join the family gospel singer sumusola baby and yinka okeleye have caused this tear online with their unusual type of wedding Unlike the typical wedding receptions of music, dance and food, Sumisola and Yinka went overboard as they introduced the worship section. The love bears who are strong Christians turned their wedding into a revival. Sometime in March, they took to their social media page and posted their engagement pictures and videos and everyone was so happy and congratulated them. On the 1st of June, they posted their court wedding pictures and then on the 3rd of June, they had their traditional marriage. The wedding happened on Saturday, the 5th of June, 2023. Gospel artists Moses Bliss and Victor Thompson were there to do the best man and groomsmen duties. We also have other gospel artists turn up for this event, the likes of Judy K, Yada, Dari Justify, and a lot of worship singers. With these people I've mentioned present at the wedding, it's obvious that this wedding is Christian wedding, kingdom based, Jesus children, children of God, people that want to go to heaven, people that love Jesus, people that are not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, they are the people that are getting married. So after they had gone to church and they were joined by their pastor, they showed up at their reception venue and at a point, it became an intense worship section. They took out a special time to worship God, you know, cry and wail in his presence, just appreciate him for bringing them thus far. And then there's a viral video that left many people divided and they faulted the couple for being extreme while of course there are others that applauded them for what they did. I'm just going to let the clip play for a while. So clearly you guys can see what's going on in this video it was just a moment of intense worship god was honored god was glorified and yeah so under the viral video we have lots of comments i'm just going to read a few to you guys this one said this is how kingdom marriage is supposed to be christ is all that matters any day anytime anywhere we live to lift god's name higher in every sphere this marriage is blessed amen this one said this is their identity in christ what is happening is a representation of who they are and it's also their choice choice it's the same way some court members choose to identify or fly their barrettes on their wedding day or two ballers agreeing to bring strippers to their after party so my people it all comes down to choice and what they are representing shalom okay so there were people that didn't agree with what they did of course there are a lot of critics out there but let me read this one he said if i go to a wedding and they start all these shenanigans i did leave because i didn't tell ya all i'm coming to sing and watch people cry this one said that man will really cry for her lap now fool what sort of witness is that 
there's another comment that reads if i dress up buy a shabby pay for makeup and gele book the hotel did everything to come and eat jollof rice and have fun at your wedding and you do this just return half of my money because i could as well worship god in my house so this one said with all these ones that one no me say the husband no go still cheat so there's another comment that reads the fact that he did this doesn't mean their marriage will last you guys there are a lot of negative comments out there i can't read everything that i came across but honestly my own opinion of course i'm going to give my two cents because these are the kind of things that piss me off like it pisses me off first of all i don't really agree with people coming to give me a definition of what your event should be how it should be what you're supposed to do this is this is what should be done because nobody gives this rule if you belong to the outside and you choose to do after party and shalaya and do all those jumping up and down it is your damn business okay i was even surprised seeing negative comments under this video obviously those people don't understand how things work and then when it comes to serving god like it's just so beautiful to see that you can show it anywhere anytime and do it at your wedding as it pleases you your life your choice so people are just used to that after party you know as a wedding where we jump up and down and just dance to different music but with this couple they decide to worship god if you follow them on youtube if you follow them on instagram this is the kind of thing they do they just worship and worship and worship so there is nothing else we are supposed to expect from this wedding apart from this anyway guys on this channel we are bearers of good news i pray for the couple that their marriage will flourish they will be a blessing and a light to this generation this fire will not burn down they will continually be fired up for jesus in jesus name amen let me know what you guys think about this video please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and yeah let's congratulate them in the comment section enjoy the rest of the video yes that's right <laughs> oh father we give you praise that's right that's right oh we worship you